Did you know that the global business intelligence market is predicted to grow from $26.06 billion in 2019 to $44.16 billion by 2027? A rising need for data visualization creates a greater demand for business intelligence developers. You are on the Jelvix channel, and we're excited to share our thoughts on recent developments in tech in five minutes. As you've already guessed, today we take a closer look at the business intelligence developer's role. And don't forget to subscribe not to miss new videos. Here we go. BI, which stands for Business Intelligence, is a complex of technologies, processes, and software tools used to gather, process, analyze, and present business data. Business intelligence encompasses three main components, such as a data source that is a place where raw, unstructured data is stored, the data warehouse that's a component aimed at the standardization and transformation of data to create a single database, and BI reporting is the ultimate component that is focused on data visualization via the Business Intelligence UI. By the way, for more information about Enterprise Data Warehouse, read the article we have prepared. The link is in the description. BI Developer is a person responsible for building, improving, and maintaining business intelligence tools. His primary goal is to transform data into valuable insights. These insights can be further studied and used in making important business decisions. The average base pay of a BI data engineer in the US is $103,581 per year, with $80,000 at the low end of the range and $135,000 at the high end. Do you think the average salary for such professionals is fair enough? Share your thoughts in the comments. It's pretty obvious that the role and responsibilities of a business intelligence developer will vary depending on the type and size of the business and the industry it belongs to. Yet, in most cases, the job typically involves the duties, namely, defining requirements for business intelligence solutions, as BI data engineers determine the types of data to be analyzed, the reporting techniques that will be used, and the form for the presentation of the results to the end users. The next duty is transforming business requirements into technical demands. At this point, BI specialists determine the type of data visualizations and how end users will interact with them. Development, deployment, and maintenance of the BI solution are also on the list of duties. The fourth point is contributing to the data warehouse development. The last point is writing user guides and documentation. As a rule, the position of a BI software developer requires a perfect mix of technical and business knowledge. The list of BI specialists must have hard skills includes knowledge of business intelligence tools, strong software development skills, experience with databases, business analysis skills, and debugging and troubleshooting skills. And apart from hard skills, business intelligence data engineers also require a set of soft skills, including communication skills, problem-solving skills, attention to detail, and team collaboration. As a rule, when looking for a BI data engineer, most employers pay attention to the candidate's educational background. Therefore, getting a degree in computer science, software development, information technology, mathematics, or any other related field will help to get the BI position faster. In addition, many companies look for a business intelligence developer with some previous experience in the role of data analyst or SQL developer. Well, BI encompasses a broad spectrum of tools and techniques that allow companies to refine their data, derive actionable insights into the market trends, and gain a competitive advantage over business rivals. So, have you already determined if your business needs a BI developer? This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. We help top brands worldwide to innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We share the latest news about tech trends and innovations. So make sure to subscribe not to miss a single video. Also, share which topics we need to cover next on our channel. And don't forget to press the bell button. Bye for now.